7.2 number 18. Simplify. This one looks pretty bad because there's a lot of stuff happening. But what you want to keep in mind is that you're going to go step by step. Just take it one piece at a time and use the order of operations. So order of operations tells us work in parentheses first. So we're going to go ahead and take care of these guys. And this one's just going to tag along and we'll rewrite it after we have the final fraction for these guys here. So if I have x squared plus 10x plus 25, I'm going to want to factor it. These are being multiplied, so we go right to the factoring and canceling steps. Um, after that, we're going to have to take care of changing this division to multiply and flipping whatever this result is. So first we're going to factor here, x plus 5, x plus 5. And the bottom left, we get x times x plus 6 times 6x over trinomials fact, uh, factoring. So we're going to do a binomial x and x factors of 30. The add to 11 would be 5 and 6, same sign. <coughs> and now that we factored, we cancel. x plus 5, top and bottom. x plus 6 are both on the bottom, so we can't cancel them. x and x, gone. So now we have... I'm going to write, rewrite the uh, initial term there that we ignored for a few minutes. We have x plus 5 over x plus 6 divided by x plus 5 all over x plus 6 times x plus 6. <coughs> Whoops. There we go. Okay, we took care of parentheses, and now we're going to go ahead and change to multiply and flip. So we have x plus 5 over x plus 6 times, flip it over, x plus 6, x plus 6, over x plus 5. Now we cancel. x plus 5, top and bottom. x plus 6, top and bottom. And we're left with a single x plus 6. And I think I forgot a piece somewhere. Yes, I did, this guy right here. So this guy right here should have been part of the numerator. That piece right there I forgot about, so I'm going to put it right here, because I should have multiplied across 6 times x plus 5, 6x six plus 5. And then when we did the flipping, it should have been right down here. And after the canceling is all done, that 6 is still there because nothing cancels with it. And our final answer is x plus 6 over 6.